Welcome back to Ancient NJ Tartary. I wanted to show you a picture that you probably have seen. This is in California, but they were excavating a parking lot and they found that everything is built upon and on top of another city. That is all around our realm. Here you'll see this was the state capital. It goes down like five floors. We did not build the Capitol building. Our founding fathers did not. They found that structure. They may have uh, changed it very slightly, but we've never built with domes and Corinthian columns. And also here, you'll see that there were either tunnels. The gist of it is that everything's built on top of everything else. And these are the three structures that are like from London to the Vatican, to the Capitol. Do you notice the same architecture? And the obelisks. This was Rome in 1930. There's 40 foot mountains of dirt here. And this is a little meltology. These are buildings that have melted. And as you begin to, to study more in the mud flood community, you're gonna notice there was either a plasma event or a solar flare or a nuclear war that literally melted bricks. and. And here we have somebody doing a repair to the sidewalk, and they found the whole building underneath. That is what our realm is. Buildings on top of buildings on top of buildings. I'm almost to the conclusion that we might be on a 100 or 200 year reset where there's always these mud floods and then everything resets and the survivors repurpose what they don't understand. And this is uh, Delaware Street, I believe it's St. Louis. Look at the dirt. I mean, look at how small the people look. And this has happened in every place on the realm. This is a church. If you pay close attention, you'll notice that the door of the church is up high. The lighter color is actually the dirt that they removed. And then look how high the entrance of the doorway is, my goodness. This is a dynamic that I've noticed, though, that when the mud floods came in, they couldn't always dig it all out, so they just moved either created steps and made a new doorway. That's exactly how they've done it, and it's all around us. I was Ubering today, and I stopped on the corner of 14th Avenue in Newark, New Jersey. I believe the address is 88. And I look over and I see all these windows that are bricked over. This is a classic mud flood building. Do you see the stairs? Excuse the, the yellow arrows, but I'm pointing to the what would have been the first floor. And how they nearly just bricked over the rest of the windows. Look at this close up on this window. They literally just bricked over the windows and then painted it the same color so it's hard to differentiate the older brick from the new brick. And here is Benai Abraham Temple. It's a Jewish temple. It has amazing antiquitech. Look at all that antiquitech, the beautiful Corinthian columns. It sits there abandoned, built in 1909. And the same story, no pictures of any phase of construction. Um, and it is a beautiful, beautiful structure. Um, when I say Tartarian, I use it lightly. Uh, this is the inside, because maybe Tartary inherited some of the buildings from the Scythians or another civilization as well. But these are buildings that have been inherited. This is another Jewish temple in Newark. Well, that's it for now. I wish everyone love and light and keep researching and learning.